Henderson off to the early lead in the R4. Chase Burr in the 3C right to his back bumper as Burr, he'll look to the inside. Down the back straight away. Randy Henderson continues to lead in the R4.
Raceway. Down into turns one and two, down the back straightaway. The number one of Douglas Kinnemer off to the early lead. Spadaro in the second spot. As now Spadaro will go to work, he'll look to the inside, down the back straightaway, he'll get a run. Side by side into turns three and four. Spadaro on the bottom, Kinnemer in the middle. Slide job for the race lead. You got a new race leader, it's Spadaro out of turn number four. Junior, he'll look to the inside of Kenimer. They'll make contact out of turn number four. Contact between Douglas Kenimer and the front straightaway wall. That'll move him back to the third spot. A Spadaro show up front right now as those two guys running one, two, as now Kenimer will fight back to the inside. He will take the second spot. Spadaro in the 33, up top on the cushion. Everybody else around the bottom. Kinnemer in the second spot. Here comes the 09 of Chad Burgess. Chad Burgess to the second spot. Two laps to go for your race leader. It is the number 33 of Sam Spadaro. Chad Burgess in the second spot, trying to catch the 33 of Sam Spadaro. One lap to go. back straightaway side by side it's a drag race into turn number three Crenshaw will go off the back straightaway Blake Clark will slide for the race lead as we're almost three wide for second Daryl Campbell now looking for the second spot as he'll go to the inside of the number six of Caleb Crenshaw Kirk Martin in the fourth spot now into turn three and four Blake Clark is your race leader Contact between the 83 and the 6 of Crenshaw. Three wide for the second spot. The 69 on the bottom. Crenshaw in the middle. He will take the second spot. Still out front. The 88 of Blake Clark. Has just about a half a straightaway on Crenshaw, your second place car. Daryl Campbell, right to the back bumper of Crenshaw. He'll now look to the inside off of turn number four. Four laps in the books, four to go. Kirk Martin lurking back in the fourth spot. As now Campbell will pass Crenshaw for the second spot. Campbell to the second spot. This time out of turn number four, two laps to go for Blake Clark. Blake Clark, two wins on the season for that young man, as now he is looking for another one. One more lap around. Kirk Martin all the way up into the third spot now as Crenshaw falls back to fourth. Out of turn number four, heat race number two will go to the 88 of Blake Clark. Out of turn number four, John South going to step on the loud pedal. We're green flag racing for heat race number one. 
John South will go to the bottom. Here comes Jake Upchurch up top. Caden Honeycutt to the fourth spot. Down to the back straightaway. John. Oof. Jay Coon. Going to look to the inside of John South. Keep your eyes open on the top side as Honeycutt will go all the way to the cushion. Now he will take the third spot. He'll put the back bumper to the 34S. Honeycutt still going to work on the 34S. Honeycutt to the bottom side, right below the 34S is now. He will go to the second spot. Still out front, Jake Upchurch in the express car. Trying to run down the number 24 of Jake Upchurch is the 37 of Caden Honeycutt. This time by four laps down, four to go. In the third spot, it is the 72 of Jay Coon. Now the 37 of Caden Honeycutt. He has caught the back bumper of the 24 of Jacob Church. This time, out of turn number four, the white flag's gonna fly. But Caden Honeycutt is not gonna surrender. He will look now to the inside. Put it back up on the cushion, down the back straightaway. He will try to get a run. To the back bumper of Jacob Church. Out of turn number four, Jacob Church will win heat race. Green flag is out, down into turn number one. Joseph DeRemus will go back to the second spot. Out front is Gary Fox in the number 12. Kurt Martin in the third spot. Second time ever in an IMCA Southern Sport Line. Kurt Martin gonna look to the inside of Gary Fox down the back straightaway. Gary Fox up top, Kirk Martin on the bottom. Down the back straightaway, they will get single file. Fox in the top spot, Martin second, Doremus fourth, third. Fourth is Donald Owens is now to the back bumper. Goes Kirk Martin to the number 12. Last lap, six tenths of a second separated your race lead this time by. It has been cut down to four tenths, two tenths of a second faster for the number 45 of Kirk Martin. One lap to go for the number 12W of Gary Fox. Down the back straightaway for the final time. Gary Fox will put it on the cushion out of turn number four. He will win. Heat race number two. On the outside of row number two. Dennis Bissonette off to the early lead. Here comes Terry Dumas to the third spot. Keep your eyes open on the 410 of Dwayne Wolf. Rollins will fight back on the outside of Wolf as Wolf is back on the bottom. 
Rollins will get to the back bumper of Dumas. Is now Slider as the number eight will have problems. Sessions will look to run him down. On the top side, here comes Terry Dumas challenging for the second spot. Chase Neal going to freight train right behind him. Now, Sessions will slide for the second spot. Contact between Neal and Dwayne Wolf. Back up front. Smooth as can be the 818 of Bissonette. Driving away from the field now as Sessions. Still lurking in the second spot. Chase Neal will go to the third spot now. Four laps down, four to go in this one. Contact between the 20W of Jacob Witted and Dwayne Wolf. Chase Neal to the back bumper. Sessions will go around. Bissonette will go out to the early lead. Here comes Chase Neal. Chase Neal will get to the back bumper of the 818. He'll go to the top side. Dwayne Wolf in the 410 will pull off the speedway as now the 20W will go around on his own. Dennis Bissonette will bring him to the green once again off at turn number four. Watch the 416 of Chase Neal. Watch the run he gets off the cushion down the back straightaway. To the second spot goes Chase Neal. Doom is still holding off the third spot as now Manning will make contact with the back bumper of Dumas. Down the back straightaway. Chase Neal will go to the bottom. He'll show the nose to the 818. One lap to go for your race leader of Dennis Bissonette. Neal will go back to the top side. Down the back straightaway to the inside goes Chase Neal. Chase Neal on the bottom. Bissonette up top out of turn number four. Watch the drive from the 818. Dennis Bissonette will win. Down the front straightaway, Blake Clark will bring him to the early lead. Clark on the top, Bassard on the bottom. Ruben Bassard with some drive down the back straightaway. He will stay to the inside of Blake Clark. Side by side, a little bit of contact between the 51 and the 88. Now between the 16 and the 121, as both of those guys will keep the car underneath them. Back up front to the race in action. The 88 of Blake Clark is your race leader. Ruben Bassard in the second spot. The number 22 of Mikey Mason in third. John Storm in the fourth spot. Ruben Bassard to the inside of Blake Clark once again. He will push for a third time. This time by four laps in the books. Four laps to go. will go past the 88 of Blake Clark now down the back straightaway. 
out of turn number four. The white flag's gonna fly. One lap to go for the 51 of Ruben Bassard. Clark will get back to the back bumper of Bassard, but he's not gonna have enough down the back straightaway. The 51, Ruben's automotive machine out of turn number four will win heat race number two. Blake Clark in second. Down the back shadowway, Tim Butler and Howard Watson having a battle up front for the race lead. Watson on the bottom. Butler up top. Butler, your race leader, out front. Watson in the second spot. Butler down into three and four. Watson in the third spot. Second spot, the 24C of Randall Cardi in the third spot. Watson will look to the inside of Butler, not gonna happen. turn number four this time Butler will take one lap to go here comes William Kreese but out of turn number four Tim Butler will win heat race number one Watson in second The number 24 out front. As now Bevels is gonna look to the inside for the second spot. Now he'll switch to the outside. So Masterson will make contact with a tire in turn number three and four. As we're halfway complete in this one, Bevels now looking for the race lead on the bottom.
Bevels will look for the crossover out of turn number two. Down the back straightaway, Bevels will go to the race lead. Slide job for the race lead as now they'll make contact. Bevel's gonna look to the inside now. He'll switch it over. Down into turn number three and four. Bevel's on the bottom. He will try to take the race lead at the line. Too close to call. One lap to go. Bevels will have to check up. Out of turn number four. Green flag is out. all the way up to the sixth spot. Here comes Claude Estes on the bottom, side by side with the R4 of Randy Henderson. Christian Kennison in the fourth spot. Keep your eyes open, Parker, back in the field. Here comes Chad Wilson. Christian Kennison will go around in turn number four. star number 20 machine back up front kenny taylor makes contact with the outside wall here comes dj estes slide job for the race lead kenny taylor will battle back on the inside here comes chad wilson chad wilson still on the bottom he will look to the inside for the race lead off at of turn number four not gonna happen kenny taylor back to the front reagan reed will hop off the cushion in turn three and four Turn number four, Kenny Taylor will bring him back to the race lead. Heads up. Oh, Chad Wilson on the bottom. He'll have to shut it down. Chad Wilson to the race lead. Three wide for the six spot. Here comes Chase Burr. Chase Burr to the top five. Back up front, Chad Wilson now. Going to try to drive away from the rest of the field. Chad Wilson up top. He'll almost hop the cushion. Chad Wilson will hop the cushion, but get it back underneath him. He will go back to the bottom. Kenny Taylor trying to hold off the 74E of Claude Estes. Is now Estes will get to the back bumper. Estes up top. Kenny Taylor on the bottom. That's the battle for second. Chad Wilson, halfway in this one, 10 laps in the books. Chad Wilson in the number 20. Randy Henderson will go around once again. Out front. Chad 
Wilson will put it back on the cushion. Claude Estes still in the second spot. Ryan Hall is now problems for the 74 of Claude Estes. He will pull to the infield. That'll move the 79 machine of Ryan Hall to the second spot. Zane Lawrence to third. John South in the 34S up front. Joseph Doremus on the top side. He's trying to run down the 34S of John South. Jake Upchurch will throw a slide job for the second spot. Slide job once again for the number 24 at Jake Upchurch. John South on the top side. He will lead lap number five. Jake Upchurch trying to run down the 34S of John South. The car on the move right now, the number 22 of Gregory Muirhead. Muirhead all the way up to the seven spot. Now to the six spot, down the back straightaway. Jake Upchurch in the number 24. Honeycutt. Well now, three wide for the race lead. Honeycutt in the middle. South on the top. John South. John South in the 34S, he is your race leader right now on the top side. 
Honeycutt going to try to go around him even higher on the top. Church to second. Now here comes Gregory Muirhead down the back straightaway. Gregory Muirhead from the outhouse to the White House for the 22 as he's into the top three. Honeycutt will bring him back to the green flag. Here comes Devin Burgess in the 64. Muirhead to the second spot. Muirhead to second. Caden Honeycutt. Now starting to drive away from the rest of your field. Fourteen laps in the books. Continuing to be your race leader down the back straightaway. Gregory Muirhead trying to run down Honeycutt as right now he needs a caution desperately. Two laps to go for Caden Honeycutt in the number 37. The white flag is out. Down the back straightaway for the final time. The JL Racing number 37 of Caden Honeycutt will win night number three. Bissonette will go to the bottom. Here comes Blake Clark up top. Blake Clark trying to double down tonight. Blake Clark on the top. Here comes Ruben. Ruben Bassard. Slide job for the race lead. Terry Dumas in the 55D. As now Ruben Bassard will throw it off in. Into turn number one as that car's a little snug in the center. He will get to the back bumper of the 88 of Blake Clark. To Blake Clark. Sessions will slow on the back straightaway. Oh 
Clark will look to the inside of Bissonette. Not going to happen. Keep your eyes on the number 51. The battle up front is a hot one for sure. Right now, you've got Bissonette on the top, Clark in the middle, Ruben Bassard searching anywhere he can to try to find some moisture. This time, he'll put it up on the top, slam it down, he'll get a run down the back straight away. To the inside of Clark right now. Clark will try to pinch him off on turn number four, but Ruben will try to get a run. He'll slide right back behind the 88 of Clark. Bassard in the 51 cannot quite get it done this time by nine laps in the books for the 818. Number 10 will go to the 818. Ruben Bassard will go to the inside of Clark. Now he will take the second spot. Now he will set his sights on the 818 of Dennis Bissonette. Ruben Bassard trying to catch the 818 as he will get to the back bumper. But does he have enough to get to the inside and make a run for the race lead? Ruben Bassard on the bottom. Bissonette on the top side. Knock, knock. You got company. It's the 51 of Ruben Bassard. Dennis Bissonette has all he wants for the race lead right now. As he'll block the bottom side, he'll slide up top. That will allow Ruben Bassard to get to the inside. Five laps to go of Ruben Bassard. Five laps to go for the 818 of Dennis Bissonnette. Ruben Bassard on the top. He'll push just a little bit. He will get a run off of turn number two. Here comes Ruben Bassard. Dennis Bissonnette continuing to lead. Does Ruben Bassard have enough laps and enough car to get to the back bumper and make a move for the race lead? Chase Neal pushing the 51 machine around the racetrack.
flag is out. One more lap to go for the 818. Into three and four for the final time. Bissonette will shut it down on the bottom. He will win. Watson out front. Butler in the second spot. Cardi gonna slide Watson. Howard Watson running in the top spot right now. Cardi in second. Here comes Frank Lackey. Howard Watson out front. Second is Cardi. Cardi will get to the back bumper of Howard Watson. Does he have enough to make the pass? Frank Lackey gonna look to the inside of Watson. Lackey on the move in the number 41. Lackey will get to the back bumper of Howard Watson. Watson continuing to drive away from the field. Frank Lackey on the bottom. Cardi up top. Here comes Steven Bevels. Bevels in the top four looking for more as now he'll go to the outside of Cardi. Bevels to the inside for the third spot. Ten laps down, ten to go. Frank Lackey. Now, in the crosshairs of the 7S to Steven Bevels. Bevels gonna go upstairs. He'll look for the crossover. to the 
second spot. Lackey going to try to fight back on the inside. Not going to happen. Bevels now going to look for the race lead as now he will try to run down the 11-H of Howard Watson. Steven Bevels trying to run down the 11-H of Howard Watson. <laughs> Lap traffic is going to cause Bevels to get to the back bumper. Five laps to go for your race leader. Job. Here comes Bevels down the back straightaway. Bevels to the inside goes Bevels. Two laps to go. Watson goes back around the outside. Bevels will stay. One lap to go. White flag is out, but nobody's ready to surrender. The 7S of Bevels on the bottom. Watson up top. Down the back straightaway. Who wants it more? One more corner to go. Bevels on the bottom. He will shut it down and try to get a run. Watson will push up. 